Hi there, I'm Nera from Frontitude, and I'm here to show you how you can use Frontitude's multi-language support to build a design-driven localization process that will bridge the gap between localization and design. So let's get started with a quick setup. First, you should configure the languages your product supports in your Frontitude workspace. Go to Workspace Settings, then click on the Localization tab. Here you can add all your target languages. This will allow you to store all the translations for each language as well as your source copy. Next, you should pick the project you'd like to translate. Content for translations can be uploaded to Frontitude either from your team's design tool or just import a file. Next, you should make sure you finalize the copy and the source language. To prevent any mistakes from happening, Frontitude won't enable to submit any translations as long as the source copy was not marked as final. So once that's done, and your project is open on Design View, you should set the language you'd like to translate to. For that, use the Language drop-down on the upper right part of your screen. So now you can get the magic done and start translating directly on the designs with a full context. One of the best parts is that the localization project or project manager can easily track and review the translations at any time. Using Frontitude's filtering function, you can look for copy that was set as draft, copy that is waiting for review, or copy that is set as final. You can even look for copy that is still pending for translation. And since Frontitude was built for collaboration, the entire review process is done super easy here. You could add comments, see the version history, at mention team collaborators, and a lot more which makes the entire process super efficient. So once your translations are ready, don't forget to mark them as final and assign them with unique keys so they can be handed off to the developers. And some other really important things you should know about. First, if the copy of the source language was modified, the translators are automatically notified with a pop-up warning here that mentions that the copy was updated so they can either keep the current translations or adjust them to the new copy. The second part is Frontitude's copy components, which lets it create reusable copy elements out of both the source copy and the target languages. This means, for example, you can choose a button such as Book Now, translate it once, and reuse it again in the product without translating it again. So this is it. Once your translations are ready, you can hand off the project easily to the developers using Frontitude's developer integration or the export feature. Thank you for watching. To learn more, I recommend you read our official guide or set a demo call with our team. Bye-bye.